Hey guys, it's Bandito Fiddles. <laughs> and we're doing something new today. So, um, I think Bandito Fiddles is playing Sid 5 right now. It's um, our background thing, so you yeah. don't have to watch a blank screen. Yeah. <laughs> today, we're going to be doing a horribly, horribly, terribly... Oh, your mic's uh, really, really shitty right now. Is it quiet? Yeah. No, it's just like, it's all this moving around. Oh, sorry, I was moving my computer. It was a horribly written fanfiction. It's gonna be, uh, our new weekly thing. It, this, this fanfiction is so bad, it's a meme. I have never read it. I have. And it's horrible. <laughs> Alright. Well, without any uh, further ado, let's get right to it. Okay. My Immortal. Oh, Up, chapter one, author's note. Special fangs, get it? Because I'm gothic. To my girlfriend, ew, not in that way, Raven. Bloody Tears 666 for helping me with the story and spelling. You rock. Justin, you're the love of my depressing life. You rock to MCR rocks. Okay, that's interesting. I got AIDS from that first sentence. <laughs> Hi. My name is Ebony Darkness Dementia Raven Way, and I have long Ebony Black Shut the Fuck Up. <laughs> Not even the first sentence. <laughs> and it's run on, too. It's ridiculous. What's with that name? I want to, like, permit, commit Sudoku on myself. Sudoku? <laughs> yeah, Sudoku. Like that picture on Tumblr. Anyways, that's how. And I have long Ebony Black hair, as opposed to Ebony White hair. That's how I got my name. Your parents need you, Ebony. You had long black hair when you were born. Ironically, while you're saying this, I just met the Aztecs. It just scared the shit out of me a little bit. <laughs> With purple streaks and red tips that reach my mid-back and icy blue eyes like limpid tears, and a lot of people tell me I look like Amy Lee. Author's note, comp bracket, author's note. If you don't know who she is, get the hell out of here. I don't I know who she is. <laughs> I'm not related to Gerard Way, but I wish I was because he's a major fucking hottie. Why would you want to be related to someone who you're attracted to? <laughs> um, I'm an empire, but my teeth are straight and white. You're a vet. What? <laughs> this is a Harry Potter fic, mind you. I have pale white skin. I'm also a witch. Okay. I go to a magic school called Hogwarts in England, where I am in Your my... Your mic's really, really shitty, bro. Okay. Like, stop moving. <laughs> um, where stop am I? Stop wanking off the story, gosh. Uh, <laughs> I <call> shit! <laughs> Keep going. Hold on, hold on, I closed it. You <laughs> dumbass. Fucking <laughs> retard. Where I'm also in my seventh year. I'm 17, period. I'm a goth, in case you couldn't tell. Oh yeah? You don't say. I wear mostly black. I love Hot Topic and I buy all my clothes from there. Of For example, you. today I was wearing a black corset with matching lace around it and a black leather miniskirt, pink fishnets, and black combat boots. I really don't think that's hard Hogwarts uniform. Bitch should get expelled. I was wearing black lipstick, white foundation, black eyeliner, and red eyeshadow. Is she a fucking ghost or something? Don't even go there. I don't, don't want to go there. Hogwarts. It was snowing and raining at the same time. So there was <laughs> what snow? <laughs> no, it was snowing and raining. So there was snowflakes and rain. <laughs> I'm oh. pretty sure it's called wet snow or freezing rain. <laughs> no, because wet, wet snow is just wet snow and freezing rain is freezing rain. Yeah, apparently it was snowing and raining, bro. At the same time. <laughs> Yo, but this is Hogwarts. Anything can happen. I was happy about. A lot of preps stared at me, and I, I put my middle finger at them because I'm a badass. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Ebony, shouted a voice. I looked up. It was Draco. It, it was drrr, Draco Malfoy. I don't know why there was like a dot dot dot. Fucking retard. Oh my god. It was. Drum roll, please. <laughs> What's up, Draco? I asked. Nothing, he said shyly. But then I heard my friends call me and I had to go away. <laughs> okay. Author's note. Is it good? Please tell me, Fangs. End of chapter one.
I want to cut myself. <laughs> okay. Chapter two. Oh, God. Shut up. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> number two. Bloody Tears 6664, number four. Helping me with the chapter. The chapter. BTW. Prep stop flaming my story, okay? No. <laughs> The next day, I woke up in my bedroom as a postal, and it was snowing and raining again. <laughs> I think this is going to be a theme. I opened the door of my coffin and drank some blood from a bottle I had. I don't think blood is the best. The bottles are the best place to keep blood, in my opinion. I don't think it's the healthiest to have in the morning, bro, you know. <laughs> my coffin was ebony black. Oh, uh, uh, and ebony pink <laughs> inside, and it was hot pink velvet with black lace at the end. I got out of my coffin and took my giant M... Why'd you stop? I read that right. I'm not dyslexic. And took of my... <laughs> took of... Took of... Took of my giant MCR shirt. I don't know what... Oh, my chemical arm. Horrible band. T-shirt, which I use for pajamas. Instead, I put on a black leather dress a pentagram necklace, combat boots, and black fishnets on. I put four on four pairs of earrings in my pierced ears, as opposed to your pierced titty. <laughs> and well, yeah, my, it happens. Like my hair in kind of a messy, in a kind of messy bow. My friend Willow, author's note, Raven, this is you. Woke up and grinned at me. She flipped her hair, her long waist length Raven black hair with pink streaks and opened her forest green eyes. <clears throat> so she grinned and then opened her eyes. <laughs> it's creepy. It's creepy as fuck. <laughs> she, Hi. Put on, she put on her Marilyn Manson t-shirt with a black mini, fishnets, and pointy high heel boots. We put on makeup, black lipstick, white foundation, and black eyeliner. Oh yeah, surprise, surprise. OMFG, I saw you talking to Draco Malfoy yesterday, she said excitedly. Yeah, so I was blushing. Do you like Draco? She asked as she went out of the Slytherin common room in and into the Great Hall. He's right into the Great Hall. Right into the Great Hall. No, okay, it's... I don't know. I, I don't know a lot about Harry Potter, but I'm pretty sure there's some distance. <laughs> yeah. There is. No, I so fucking dull, I shouted. Yeah, right, she explained. Ex explained. Exclaimed. Just then, Draco walked up to me. Hi, he said. Hi, I replied flirtily. How do you say hi flirtishly? Hi. <laughs> Guess what? You said. <laughs> it's like fucking. <laughs> hi. Hi. While you say hi, like. I do it beautiful. <laughs> Guess what? He said. What? Well, good Charlotte are having a concert in Hogsmeade. He told me. What? You're moving. You're moving again. <laughs> no, this isn't right. <laughs> Nothing about the story is right. <laughs> I like Good Charlotte. Per I'm, I'm talking about Kisama H now. Kisama H loves Good Charlotte. <laughs> Stop moving! <laughs> so you're rubbing your ass against the microphone. No, I'm rubbing my hands on it. <laughs> oh my fucking god, I screamed. I love GC. They are my favorite band besides MCR. Well, do you want to go with me? He asked. I gasped. <gasps> End of chapter two. <laughs> <laughs> I gasped. See? <laughs> <laughs> I gasped. End scene. Shit. Um, okay, chapter three. <laughs> Author's note. Stop flaming the story, preps, okay? Otherwise, thanks to people... To the utter, utter, wait, I'm sorry, wait, say that again? Stop flaming yeah. the story, preps, okay? Otherwise, otter, like O-D-D-E-R, apparently, wise, W-I-Z-E, thanks to the gothic people for the good reviews. Fangs agon, agon, you can't even spell again? I can't. Oh, fuck yourself. <laughs> Raven. Oh yeah, BTW. I don't own this or the lyrics for Good Charlotte. No shit. <sighs> On the night of the concert, I put. Mind you, there's 44 chapters, guys. 
<laughs> I put on my black lace up boots with high heel what underneath them there were ripped red fish nets. Then I put on a black leather mid mi mini dress with all this corset stuff in the back and front. I put on matching fishnet on my arms. I straightened my hair and made it look all spiky. I felt a little depressed then, so I slit one of my wrists. <laughs> Alright. I think I might do the same. <laughs> I read a depressing book while I waited for it to stop bleeding and listened to some GC. Normally, when people want to stop bleeding, they put a tissue on their cut. Not this woman. <laughs> <laughs> she just reads. If I read the pain, will go away. <laughs> I painted my nails black and put on tons of black eyeliner. Tons. She literally put a ton of eyeliner on her face. That's not good for your face, bro. Then I put on some black lipstick. I didn't put on foundation. I was pale anyway, so why do you put it on any day? <laughs> I drank some human blood as opposed to drinking anal blood. <laughs> Animal blood. You know how so it is, bro. I was ready to go to the concert. I went outside. Draco was <laughs> waiting there in in front of his flying car. He was wearing a simple plan t-shirt. They would play at the show, too. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. He has a flying car, too? Apparently, this is a... Well... I would assume you're that... rich, right? So... Yeah, but I mean, like... Well, how else... Like, you're a wizard, Harry. <laughs> you're a wizard, Harry. Well, I mean, like... Ron's family has a Ron's family. <laughs> uh, okay. I think Draco's mouth um, Draco's dad has like a, a roll. <laughs> Draco's roll. mouth. <laughs> Draco's mouth has like a Bentley that flies fuck. Oh, it's a Mercedes Benz. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Hold on. I just skipped a couple of paragraphs. Fuck. Black Baggy black skater pants. What are skater pants? Are they jeans? Are they what? I, I think you're talking about sweatpants. Skaters? I don't know any skaters that wear black. Ska um, She's retarded. She. Right? Oh, it's a she. I, I apologize. Yeah. Uh, well, uh, I don't know very many men that wear corsets. You're the person who wrote this. What the fuck? What? Anyways. <laughs> black nail polish and a little eyeliner. Author's note. A lot of cool boys wear it, okay? Yeah. Hi, Draco, I said in a depressed voice. Hi, Ebony, he said back. He walked into his flying black Mercedes Benz. The license plate said 666. Oh. And the place <laughs> On the way, we listened excitedly to Good Charlotte and Marilyn Manson. We both smoked cigarettes and drugs. What cigarettes? <laughs> what like... <laughs> oh, so we both we both smoke cigarettes and drugs. And drugs. <laughs> <laughs> Just nonchalantly. At the same time, like four cigarettes and like they did MDMA while doing it. <laughs> we are that much of a boss. When when we got there, we both hopped out of the car and went into the mosh pit in front of the stage and jumped up and down as we listened to Good Charlotte. I'm not gonna sing this shit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Joel is so Please serenade us with your voice. No, I won't. Joel is so fucking hot, I said to Draco, pointing at him as he sung, filling the club with his amazing voice. Suddenly, Draco looked sad. What's wrong? I asked as we moshed to the music. Then I caught on. Hey, it's, it's okay. What? It's, it's okay, okay to be I gay. I like him better than you, I said. Really? He asked. Oh, Draco Malfoy. <laughs> really? I said. Besides, I don't even know Joel, and he's he's going out with Hillary fucking Duff. I hate that little bitch. <clears throat> I, oh, I fucking hate that little bitch. <laughs> I said, disgustedly thinking of her ugly blonde face. I think I'd rather hit, 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 hit Hillary Duff than this chick. What is that chick? <laughs> I don't know. A vampire! I know, but like race-wise? A vampire! A vampire's a race now! <laughs> Yes! The okay. night went on really well, and I had a great time. So did Draco. <laughs> After the concert, we drank some beer at, and asked Benji and Joel for their autographs and photos with them. We got GC concert tees. 
Draco and I crawled back into the Mercedes Benz, but did, but Draco didn't want didn't go back into Hogwarts. He instead drove the car into the Forbidden Forest. <laughs> End of chapter four. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like it's like is it gonna get good? Wait, how how long have you been recording? Um, about thirteen minutes. <laughs> okay, we'll do up to chapter five. We'll do five chapters at a time, I guess. <sighs> this is not even like enjoyable. There's nothing we can be like. This game is not bad. No, that game story. <laughs> this story is all bad. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's what makes it good. It's like, was this the inspiration to Fifty Shades of Grey or something? It could be. <laughs> okay, this is okay. Publishers note. Okay, this is the people that are posting this because the the, the girl who wrote, originally wrote the story took it down. <clears throat> Publishers note: Warning: This chapter contains Tara's ideas of a lemon, which is porn. So if you're not mature enough to handle this, skip it. You decide. Also, our viewers, you've been warned. <laughs> what viewers are reading this shit? I know, but the people who some for some reason for some god awful reason watch us. Anyways, authors know. I said stop, stop, S T U P. Stop. Flaming. Okay, Ebony's name is Ebony, not Mary Sue. Okay, Draco is so in love with her that he is acting different. Different. They, they knew each other. Each other. Each other. Each other. Before. Okay. Draco, I shouted. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Draco didn't answer me, but he stopped the flying car and he walked out of it. He just walked out? He just walked out. <laughs> he stopped in midair or something? <laughs> he just stops in midair and walks out. These bitches. <laughs> he didn't even want to live with this chick. He just killed himself. Does that tell you something? I walked out of it too. Yes, she killed herself. What the fucking hell? I asked angrily. What the fucking hell? <laughs> Ebony, he asked. What? I snapped. Draco leaned in extra close and looked and I looked into his gothic eyes. He was wearing color contacts, which revealed so much depressing sorrow and evilness then and then I suddenly didn't feel mad anymore. <laughs> and then suddenly and then? just as just as I just as I Draco kissed me passionately. Just as I, just as I Draco, <laughs> just as I Draco, Draco climbed on top of me, and we started to make out keenly against a tree. He took off my tank top, and I took off his clothes. I even took off my bra. He put his thingy in my, you know what, and we did it. <laughs> this is time. a terrible porno. <laughs> <laughs> he put, fuck. All right. On a side note, I was fucking building Stonehenge, and it was five turns from being done, and somebody built it. Bro, remember, <laughs> remember that hor like that purposely horrible fanfic I wrote? Yes. <laughs> I think it's better than this. <laughs> that, oh, will be oh, that will be read Oh, I screamed. <laughs> I was beginning to get an orgasm. <laughs> we started to kiss everywhere, and my pale body became all warm. And then, what the hell are you, mother? What are the hell are you doing, motherfuckers? It was Dumbledore. <laughs> 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 oh, <shit. laughs> <I can't>. <laughs> <laughs> One sec. Dumbledore, Dumbledore of all people. Dumbledore just called two of his students motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> what a badass. Okay, guys, I don't know sure if you're hearing this. If you're, if you're, anyone who watches this, anyone who comes across this. What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> Cha that's the end of chapter four. Okay. Ugh. Chapter five. Stop flamming. If you flam, it means you're a prep or a poser. And by poser, it's poser. The only reason Dumble Dumble Dior, what is he, Kristen Dior now? Fine. Spar, it's because he had a head axe. Okay, and on top of that, he was mad at them having sex with two X's. 
P.S. I'm not updating until I get five good revowies. Revowies? But yeah. apparently he updated 42 times. <laughs> 44. Oh, I, I apologize. 44. Actually, 39 times after this. Mm. <laughs> On to the next chapter. <laughs> Dumbledore <laughs> made and Draco and I followed him. I would. I kept shouting. He kept shouting at us angrily. You ludicrous fools! What is, is he black now? <laughs> you might think this is ludicrous. But Dumbledore, tell us how you feel. <laughs> Dumbledore's gonna like rap to them now. He's like, "X, don't give it to you." <laughs> he's gonna, he's hey, yo, he's gonna get the D. <laughs> I started to cry, tears of blood down my pallid face. Why would you cry tears of blood? How? Draco comforted me. When we went back to the castle, Dumbledore took us to Professor Snape and Professor McGonagall, oh, who Snape. were looking very angry. It's Levio's <laughs> <laughs> they, they were having sexual intercourse in the Forbidden Forest, he yelled in a furious voice. Why did you do such a thing, you mediocre dunces? <laughs> that sounds like Snape, though. That was McGonagall. <laughs> How dare you, demanded Professor Snape. Mm, then Draco, mm. shri Draco shrieked. Because I love her. <laughs> <laughs> Did that, that escalated quickly? <laughs> Everyone was quiet. Dumbledore and McGonagall still looked mad, but Professor Snape said, Fine, very well, you may go up to your rooms. <laughs> <laughs> Not like Snape at all. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking shit. So... so Draco and I went upstairs while the teachers glared at us. Are you okay, Ebony? Draco asked me gently. Yeah, I guess. I lied. I went into the girls' dorm, brushed my teeth and my hair, and changed into a low-cut black floor-length dress with red lace all around it and black high heels. <gasps> that was one sentence. There was, <laughs> Take a breath, no, there was no comma there. When I came out, dot dot dot, Draco was standing in front of, in the in front of the bathroom. What? What? <laughs> what? I'm a wizard. I can do what the fuck I want. No, no, no. Okay, let me explain to you something about the Harry Potter like dorm situation. If I'm not mistaken. Girls can go to doors, boy, the door, boys' dorms, because most of the girls are not skanky, in Harry Potter at least, and they trust the girls. But if a boy tries to go into the girls' dorm, the stairs fall, and they like slide down, something like that. They're but they're like for some reason not allowed to go out there. Okay. So how is Draco getting there? He's a wizard. Gosh. Also, Robo Bandito fiddles. <laughs> what happened? You sound like a robot. Wait, no, it's gone. Never mind. It's gone. Okay. All right. So both of Marks have been doing weird shit. Apparently. Okay. Draco was standing in front of the bathroom. And he started to sing, I just want to live by good Charlotte. I was so flattered, even though he wasn't supposed to be there. We hugged and kissed. After that, we said goodnight, and he reluctantly ran back to his room. And he fucked. And <laughs> masturbated silently. Silently. <laughs> That's the end of chapter five. Uh, you think we can squeeze in? Now we can squeeze in one more chapter. We'll make this 30 minutes. Is it 30 minutes? No, it's 20 right now. Oh, Ish. this so. Okay. We can we can push a little more. <laughs> Publishers note: So Jade has been updating for the past uh, for the last five days, and now it's my turn. Unfortunately, my internet is slower than Jade, so I don't get to go on the computer as often. This means that it is a possibility that updates won't come as often, won't come every day like they used to. I'll try my hardest though. Oh, and Jade will be responding to reviews now. So she may not give as cool of a reply as me. Enjoy, Olivia. This is the people who are posting this. Uh, authors note. Sh what? S H J T of preps. Okay. P S. I will not. I I I I will not <laughs> update until you give me good revows. Revows. Yes. Revows. Yeah, revows. Definitely, bro. Definitely. The next day, I woke up in my coffin. I put on a black mini skirt that was ripped all around the end and a matching top with red skulls and all over it high heeled boots that were black. What? <sighs> I don't know. 
I put on two pairs of skull earrings, two crosses in my ear. Wouldn't that burn her? Mm, you think so? And I spray painted my hair with purple. She used spray paint in her hair. Okay. In the hall, I ate some Count Chocula cereal with blood instead of milk and a glass Count of red. Count Chocula cereal? Yeah. She would. She didn't even spell Chocula right. She even spelt it right? She didn't. I, I, I think she did. I don't know. Suddenly, someone bumped into me. All the blood spilt all over my, my top. Bastard, I shouted angrily. I regretted saying it when I looked up because... I was looking into a pale white face of a gothic boy with spiked black hair and red streaks in it. He was wearing so much eyeliner that it was going down his face, and he was wearing black lipstick. He didn't have glasses anymore, and now he was wearing red contact lenses, just like Draco's. And there was a scar on his forehead, and there was no scar on his forehead anymore. Can you tell who it is? It's Dumbledore. <laughs> He had a man. He had a manly stubble on his chin. Oh, well, just one though. Just one manly. <laughs> he had a man giant on his chin. <laughs> he had a dirty cunt on his chin. He, <laughs> he had a sexy English accent. He looked Both exactly. Sure. Oh, wrong accent. <laughs> Madden. He was so sexy that my body went all hot. And when I saw him, kind of like an erection, only I'm a girl. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't what? get I didn't get one you sicko. I'm sorry, I don't I um <sighs> She has a boner. Oh she has a boner. <laughs> I'm so sorry, he said in a shy voice. Why why is every guy shy in this? That's alright. What's your name? I question. But you know him. <sighs> My name's Harry Potter. Although most people call me vampire these days, he grumbled. What the fuck? People just call him vampire. <laughs> Yo, Why? vampire, what you doing? <laughs> Why, I explained. Because I love the taste of human blood. He giggled. He giggled. He giggled. He giggled. <laughs> he giggled. <laughs> 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 well, I am a vampire, I confess. Really? I w he, whis he whimpered. He whimpered! What? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I roared. See. <laughs> we sat down to talk for a while. Then Draco came behind me. It came up behind me and told me he had a surprise for me. So I went away with him. Penis. I was just gonna say. <laughs> chapter seven, guys. All right. I think before we continue, I guess this will be the end for this chat for this segment of um, terrible fan fiction. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, we'll see you next couple chapters. Oh God. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs>